Here's the field for race number two, Condition Trotters, racing one mile, a purse $2,200, a field of seven. Number one, Angelica Super, Omar Ruby, host of of Beach City, Charlie Myrick, the trainer driver. Number two, Dusty Gill, owned by Iris Harwitz of Brooklyn, New York. Tim Rocker trains, Debbie Rocker drives. The three boombox, so and then trained by William Stander of Mansfield, Del Mellora. Number four, Super High Power. Oh, my Mike Saylor Jr. of Lebanon, John Collins, the trainer driver. Five, Hot Action, owned by Tom Weber of Stryker, John Zimmerman of Defiance, Jim Daly trains, Dave Miller getting the call. The Six Hills Nutter Butter, owned by Sturgill Loman of Bainbridge, Jim Arledge of Circleville, Jim Arledge trains, Randy Tharps drives. And the Seven Treasure Always, owned by the Arden Homestead Stable of Goshen, New York, Al Gobble, the trainer driver. Win play show perfect, a trifecta. Second race, condition claiming Trotters, lining up, moving in. They're on the back stretch. There they go. And uh, they're off, and it seals Nutter Butter from the far outside, surging first for the lead from the inside second. It's Boombox. Off the rail in third, Angelica Super Dusty Gill from between horses in fourth. Super High Power looks to mangle in five. The inside sixth, Hot Action at the rail seventh, the two year old treasure always. Dusty Gill jumps it off here as off stride as well as treasure always. But on the front, unaffected, it's Hills Nutter Butter. Tharps now with a lead here. They set the pace early. Boombox on the inside, racing in second. At the rail third, Angelica Super. Opening quarter in 30 and one-fifth of a second. Trotters in straight alignment now as they come to the stretch. And it's the 7-1. to one. Hills Nutter Butter leading by two over Boombox. Followed by Angelica Super and first to move now. Here comes Super High Power. And Dusty Gill back into contention despite the break is now second over in fifth. At the rail in sixth, hot action. Treasure always for the back, trailing in seventh. Trotting into the clubhouse turn, Hills Nutter Butter has a lead, but now super high power ranging up alongside, pressuring that leader. Half and 101, four fifths as they make the turn to the back stretch. Hills Nutter Butter a half a length. Outside, super high power, and at the rail is Boombox, Dusty Gill, and now gapping the cover, three lengths in fourth. At the rail, Super Angelica trotting in fifth, hot action trots in sixth. Treasure always is closing steadily on the inside in seventh. As they race down the back stretch, and they're con they continue to battle it out of the front. On the outside, super high power puts a nose in front. Hills Nutter Butter, a game second, three quarters, 131 and three fifths. And to the outside, trotting in third, boom box. The, to the far outside comes Angelica Super as she moves into striking position. Now less than an eighth of a mile ago, and it's still Hills Nutter Butter looking to wire the field, but super high power. One big move here sends her to the front. Super high power, home free as she opens up with the field. The battle here is for place. Super high power, very tight for second. Here is the winner, number four, Super High Power, a, a three-year-old son of Super Gill from the Speedy Scott Mare, Melina Elmahurst. Number Mike Saylor Jr. of Lebanon, John Collins, the trainer driver, Super High Power in only his first year of racing, now scoring his second career win. That equals his lifetime best made at Hoosier Park, two minutes, four thumbs. Six and a scratch.